My name is Ladarian Wilder. I'm 38 years of age. I had a stroke at 37 years of age. Uh, to me, it wasn't nothing wrong with me. It, it, my, I, I know my blood pressure was high. I, like I just said, I should have been up on it, but I, ain't, I thought it was a joke. I was a joke until I was on the floor. You know, I have a headache. Like it was, a, it was like a migraine into the third degree. It's like my head was just banging. Then when my head started banging, my vision got a little blurry. Got a little blurry. So when I went to go stand up, I couldn't stand up. I was feeling weak. So I was like, I'm just gonna lay down here for a few minutes. That's when I laid on the floor. At that point, I, I ain't know exactly what was wrong with me. Even when I'm lambs came, I, I didn't know what was wrong with me because I, I couldn't speak. In this patient's case, the basilar artery, which is right here, and it passes in front of the brainstem, which is this portion, is very bright, unusually bright, and that's consistent with the clot. And so that's a devastating location for a clot to occur, and that accounted for this patient's symptoms. I was completely awake. And they did, they told me exactly what they was gonna do. They told me the procedures, what they was gonna do. Cause she showed me the blood clot. She like, it's right here. Soon as she popped it, cleaned it up, I guess what she did, I can speak. I thought I can just, just leave her out of the hospital. They like, no, you can't leave out the hospital until you uh, walk. I couldn't walk. So that was, they kept me in the hospital a couple of more days, ran some tests. Um, I had to swallow, I had to learn how to swallow again. I had to learn how to speak again and everything. Then they released me out of the hospital. I tried not to push myself to the stream. I just, I just tried to get myself back to being 100%. And when I'm 100%, then I can probably play basketball or something like that. But if I don't, if I don't work out, then it's, you're always gonna be at day one. So when you first start working out, it's hard. But the day 15, day 16 is going to be more easier. I don't eat salt that much. I changed my diet up. No sodas. Um, I eat a whole lot of vegetables, um, fruits, salads, and stuff like that. I, I changed the, the meat. Instead of eating meat and sugar all the time, I try to eat healthy. You got to have an annual checkup. And if it is prescribed, if you do, do have a heart problem, high blood pressure or something like that, it's best, a doctor will let you know, it's best stay up on it. Eat right, cholesterol, and if if you do feel some weakness or something like that, it's best to let your doctor know, or your doctor's gonna tell you something is wrong with you, if something is, and have a checkup. Recently, every time I go to the, to the doctor now, my blood pressure is down. Before I was going to the doctor, my blood pressure was high, real high. You only get one chance in life. So, and going through that, you, you don't get a repeat. Like, all right, I'm just gonna do it over again or something like that. But God bless me, I could do it like that. I have a repeat to try to fix everything before then, but you don't get a repeat in life.